there friends and enemies Joe Perrites here once again and today I have another brand new Destiny 2 video for you this one showing off the brand new fusion rifle null composure which is the ritual weapon for season of twice if you enjoy the video hit that like button make sure to subscribe to the channel it helps me out shows me that you want to see more videos like this. I'm going to take this through the override activity show off what it does and talk about the ways that you can get the most out of this rifle. so I'm running Feeding Frenzy and Reservoir Burst. If you figure out what it does, Reservoir Burst, the trait is when the battery is full, your next burst deals additional damage and causes enemies to explode on death. This is very, a very good perk, one that I missed from Loaded Question. That was one of my favorite fusion rifles in the game ever to date. So I really miss this. I wanted to try this weapon out. Now this is a void weapon instead of a uh, arc weapon. I threw on a major spec as well as fully master work to get it, which is nice. Now heating up is the other perk over here. Final blows with the weapon. Increase accuracy and stability. This might be better for PvP. Same thing with high impact reserves. Uh, make sure you throw on fusion rifle loader. It helps out a lot because you want to make sure you have your reservoir burst topped off all the time as well as scavengers etc for this one i'm also going to be running deathbringer i'm working on that catalyst the explosion there it's pretty effective especially against void shielded enemies Honestly, anywhere where enemies are super grouped up, that's where this gun is going to be most effective. Especially if they're red enemies and not major enemies. Sometimes major enemies, it won't proc because of the damage it does. It doesn't kill them in one shot. That being said, you can knock out uh, yellow bar enemies in a couple bursts. So it's not a bad gun damage-wise as long as you know... That it's just not gonna take them out in one shot, you know. Destroy countermeasures to keep it operating. Explosion is good. I wish it was a little bit stronger this gun. I feel like compared to loaded question, it's not quite as good. But that might just be a little bit of me misremembering how good loaded question was, but I'm not sure. That's just how it feels to me so far from my testing. The machine spawn collect their forces. Gather your light and prepare for battle. Mike's defenses have been reset. But like circuits that can be overloaded, continue the assault. I'm gonna go through. How so? I'm just gonna double check. Oh no.
had to solo that part because nobody came through with me. Alright, data is deposited. See, the delay in it also throws me off a little bit. I felt like before the impact would hit and it would be almost instantaneous. But it does seem to do a lot. So I added the major spec because I really want this to be a secondary major clear. And sometimes fusion rifles just don't do the trick. They don't do enough damage against the bigger enemies. In my personal opinion, okay. The vortex gathers energy, moving from potential to material. See if anybody goes through. Why is more exciting than I thought? It uses a delightful number of grenades. All right. Oh, we actually have people go through this time. Okay, cool. Swords are the best method for taking down these champions in this mode. Because of the, even after the nurse, they still do the most damage and hit the hardest against a lot of these champions. Which is crazy after how many times they've been nerfed, you know? Oh, the wyvern? Oh, no. The damage is actually pretty solid to put a spec on and everything like that to the yellow bars, which is nice because sometimes it feels like it doesn't hit hard enough or kill in one shot against certain enemies, and that can be a problem when you're trying to proc reservoir burst as often as possible. That was the fun part. I like the other one better, because these tend to get me quite often. The lasers. almost fell off. Oh, I think we have some people who don't know what they're doing, haven't done this before, gotcha. Oh, I didn't know that was a laser, no! That's my V. Oh, it starts to go all the way up here. Never mind. I'm mean. <laughs> I honestly hadn't done that version before, so I didn't know that was a laser. That was kind of funny. Now, I will say, in any kind of void burn activity or needing to break void shields no composure is going to be very good in my opinion
the hard part right now is that when you look at the mods for the season some things like the grenade launchers are going to be very strong Dude, these aren't blowing up that's crazy I wonder if that's a glitch There it is. I guess the, the harpy's not really blown up as I should. Alright, where's the the champion? See what I'm saying? Swords are still they've nerfed swords a couple times and they're still S tier. It's crazy. Although I'm, I'm very excited to see what happens this season with uh, all the grenade launcher mods because I have been dying for a grenade triple grenade launcher build and now it just actually is going to make sense instead of just being shenanigans. Also I can't believe I died there. stop me there do the the chunk damage is actually pretty decent on for this gun so maybe it'll be a sleeper for certain pvp activities because uh, the explosion is inconsistent at times and i feel like that kind of might hold it back a little bit or maybe there's just certain enemies it doesn't proc but that's gonna be tough, to be honest. Because that's the whole selling point, you know? Although, with uh, additional damage to certain enemies. Oh, I took extra melee damage. Alright. I need to stop messing around. I'm recording this live, YouTube, so. Any kind of uh, screw ups can be blamed on that, you know? I wonder if putting a box spec on this might not be a terrible idea. Anyway, uh, I hope you enjoyed the video on the brand new Null Composure. Make sure you go snag it, it's pretty easy to get. It's just kind of time consuming. Make sure you do Team Scorch. If you have not realized that that's the best way to do the devil you know. this week now later on in the season mayhem will probably be a bit faster but